Hello guys, in this video I want to show you guys a very cool app. It's called AirDroid. It's been out for a while, but I just uh, discovered it yesterday. Uh, a very amazing app. Uh, what it is, it's an app that lets you wirelessly connect your phone to your computer and from your computer you can control, you can access your phone features in a very 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 nice way and it looks beautiful too and it's it does you don't need a client for the computer so you don't have to install anything it works on windows it works on pc and it should work on linux too um so this is how this is when you open it up wait, when you open it up you're gonna get this page uh just a reminder they both the computer and the cell phone needs to be on the same wi-fi network um, when you open it up, it look, first of all, it looks very nice. It looks very nice, very appealing to the eye, very beautiful. Um, here, you would ask you to connect. What you would have to do is go to this web browser URL or to this URL IP address. And besides that, besides that, you also have other features. This app, which is the device. If you go to device you can actually see uh, the status of your phone very cool uh, you can right here you can go ahead and clear the, the memory very nice feature um, here you can go ahead and, and look at all your apps that you have installed in your phone and from here too you can also uninstall if you want which is very cool another cool way to uninstall easily um, besides that you also have a file manager which is awesome it's like having uh, uh, like all in one app you know you don't have to have an extra um, app for file browsing and you got absolutely everything here you can access everything very cool your download folder very nice and it looks very cool um, task you also have a task manager there very cool you can go ahead and stop kill apps working in the background um, network you can configure a network and you can rate the app help and about here you get rec recommendations very nice very cool app that they recommend so here let's go ahead and try this I'm using Chrome but um, and like like you can see right here I'm using the web.android.com address which is this same one um, when you open it up boom it opens up like that it looks very nice very appealing too and right here like you can see there's a code there's a passcode this is the passcode you're gonna enter or you can scan this barcode 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 right there um, let's go ahead and enter the the passcode one f six nine a T. Once you hit enter, automatically your phone is connected to the to the computer. So let's go ahead and put the phone to the side right there. Very cool. And this is what you get. It looks very nice. Um, right right away. Let's go ahead and put this full screen so you can enjoy it a little bit better. Oh, there you go very cool um, right here you can see the information of your phone the memory used the memory um, free the URL uh, you could write messages um, shortcuts and everything and here you could search the Google Play Store and install from from your, from this browser um, act here you can actually access everything that's in your phone you can access the files from your phone like right here I go ahead and hit it and these are all the files that are in your phone pretty cool and so on so on that's very nice it's like having the the it's like having the Android operating system in your computer which is very cool um, you can access your videos that you have in your camera roll uh, one thing keep in mind it won't act it won't access the external SD card it will access the internal SD card that's one thing to keep in mind and from right here you can go ahead and and watch a video I call, of course I got um, the flash blocker so it's not gonna work on me right now but this is very nice you can access everything here 
you can go ahead and close um, uh, your photos you can access your photos here when you click on one photo you could go ahead and nice photo uh, this is a panorama photo I took with my cell phone very cool very nice um, you can and you, like I said you can access every folder in your phone look at that very nice very awesome very cool these are wallpaper I got a folder full of wallpapers and right here like and you can here you also have have other features you could go ahead and add this set this as a wallpaper you could go ahead and download it to your computer uh, you could go preview left right rotate let me see if you add are you sure you want to set this as a wallpaper Let's say yes so let me see what wallpaper did it change okay not that so let's see if it's here Go, go, go. There it is. <laughs> it changed the wallpaper. Very nice. Very cool. Very cool. Uh, let's go ahead and change it again. Very cool. Let me choose another wallpaper. Let's go ahead and choose this one. Yes. Like right here. Let's see if it changes. Boom. Very nice. <laughs> that was beautiful. Awesome. And okay, so besides that, uh, like like you can see, you can access all your phone. You could also access your browser too. Like for example, I'm on my I'm on my computer. Let's ask, let's put ESPN. Dot com. So once I click enter here, it will automatically open the browser and open up ESPN.com very nice very cool um, here you can also access your music whatever music you have on your phone right now I don't carry music on my phone I use streaming so right there there's nothing you could access your contacts your frequent contacts like I said your files your apps that you have installed in your phone these are all my apps on the phone and from here you can also download the app uh, you can uninstall the app very nice very cool and it looks um, I'm telling you it looks very nice it looks uh, awesome you know it looks like a, a, a full desktop operating system in your computer using your phone and here you can also take a screenshot of your screen right now that, that would be taking a screenshot from my from my lock screen like you can see right here if I take the screenshot boom, uh, it downloads it to my computer so let's go ahead and see the there it is there's the, the screenshot very cool <laughs> very nice so let's go that's a very nice way to transfer okay if I go here as I move look at this as I move my 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 wall screen on the phone it actually moves over here if I want to take a screenshot there and save it to the computer boom hit the snapshot it took the snapshot right there and there it is very cool very nice very cool and I'm telling you guys and this is a free app and uh, you don't have to install anything on your computer it works perfectly uh, works on any browser I'm using right now Chrome this is my favorite browser um, here you have uh, some other features too other functions uh, this is, looks very cool too you could you could change the desktop look you can put the weather there very nice very cool a little bit more cleaner very cool here very nice very cool and you can also see you from right here you can also see the percentage bat of your battery life in your phone you can also see the signal strength of your phone very nice and here if you click on um, detail you can actually access every other feature you see right here that I just went over through but in a simple more simplified way 
and here you can see the memory storage internal SD card very cool your contacts your messages let's go to my messages right there you can see my messages very nice awesome and and very cool you know uh, you can access your music if you have music you can see your model number here of your phone uh, like I said your videos but this is everything you can access right here is the same thing you you would access on uh, using these using these um, icons right here which is very cool very convenient very nice I'm here let me see what you can do here you can speed install you could new message speed upload and show desktop amazing here you could go ahead and search in the Google store let's see if I can CNN and when you click CNN whatever a uh, uh, name of the app it's gonna take you to the Google Play Store from here you could go ahead and let's say I want to install you choose your device blah, blah, blah. okay I want to choose that boom and the app will be installed shortly so right here it should be downloading I don't know if I install okay here it is so the app the CNN app automatically installed to your phone very nice you go here I didn't have that app so uh, do you want uh, no I don't want to there it is there it is very cool very cool very nice um, and just remember that that's the way you know it all one tip I would give you is um, make sure you save the address that way you would always have it here like right now I have it right there a shortcut so it's very cool but let me show you guys another way that you can enter in here instead of using the barcode you can go ahead and let me see disconnect so right now if you want to connect using the barcode which is pretty cool a lot easier okay automatically it's gonna activate the the camera scan it boom automatically connected to your phone it's even easier than using the the freaking code uh, like you can see right there is connected and you could go ahead and disconnect from right there very awesome so guys I hope you guys like the 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 look of this app if you didn't know about it and till next time let me know what you guys think about this have you used it before and what you use it for